Welcome back to to a trauma center. Uh, yeah. Trauma center. Trauma, trauma, trauma team. It's a team of people in the in the trauma center. They're a trauma team. Yeah, I noticed the last time we did a uh, a mission here, we got a huge uh, trauma dump. So hopefully, we can find somewhere that we can casually insult our patients. Well, uh, what do you think, Doctor? Do you think we should move this moving heart? Mo mo moving heart? Does that mean it's like do 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 do? Dude, dude, stop! Like, that's weird! It's in your knee! <laughs> How's that? You shouldn't be there. Hold on, let me just... Oh, 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 uh. And that's what we call a heart murmur. These flowers. These butterflies, smart guy. I'm allergic. <laughs> hey, Hank. I say, where are you going with that gun on your hand? <laughs> So you're the one who takes care of the flowers? I say, I, I say, Gabe, oh, don't interrupt I'll me when me. I'm looking at flowers. They enjoy flowers. You give them love, and they blossom. You give them hate, and they poison you. <laughs> so different from humans. So, Gabe touches a lilac, and it just goes, <laughs> You did not give it love, Gabriel. Moving heart. Didn't know he had a country ballad in the 90s. This condition is I need you to one. give me a heart transplant. Like right now? Yes. It's very urgent. Hmm. Ooh. So, what's with all the fuss today? Well, you haven't heard? Someone's doing an OLCVR today. Olkver. You're kidding, right? I love Olkvers. No one does that procedure anymore. D optical lens, uh... I'll be assisting. D wait, get, uh, uh, optical lens control... Con control virtual, virtual reality. Virtual reality, yeah, 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 right, yeah. Mine? Yeah, I've been to I've been to the to, to the in services. I know. Hey, out of the way! Let me through. Thud. It's all right, man. <laughs> I thought you'd come. You're actually getting the heart so, transplant. It is you. An OLCVR? What are you thinking? You told me yourself that you're the doctor, right? Yeah, I. May have said something along those lines. So stop smoking. It's bad for you. Did we accidentally no, insult him and tell him to get a procedure he doesn't need, and so he took and our word as gospel? To lead this country, even if my life's at risk. No, it, we we told him to pull out of the race and get it checked, so he's going to do something risky and dangerous instead. It's outdated and it won't cure you. It's just a stall. At least for four years. Maybe. Uh, uh, well. You afraid? You were so strong before, preaching at me. Yeah, what's the matter, boy? Not strong anymore. <laughs> not strong enough to tell me One no to not get this procedure is what I've been telling you this up. entire time. Just realize his mustard-colored suit. I know. Not a fan. That's one to two. <sighs> it doesn't look good on you, Gabe. It doesn't match your hair or like it's your vibe. It's not beige. It's not brown. It is mustard. <sighs> All right, stockbroker previously treated for a chronic renal failure. She was admitted for an unusually long cold. There you go. I would have said cooled, but... Ah. She gave me a muscle spasm. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was just thinking about my patient offing himself. Yeah. To, uh, all right. Well, let's let's get the old jaundiced fool out of our minds and uh, get this lady in our in our, in our heads. <laughs> that old jaundiced fool. Did you know our suit is a mood suit? So when we saw jaundice in him, our, our suit changed to mustard. Shut up. Not it. <laughs> oh, sorry, Gabe. I didn't mean that. But if you are troubled, I am equipped to listen. Everything you say is being recorded and shown to the board. I also double as a therapist. Hello, Gabe. Sit down, please. Our time is up. Pay me lots of money. That's just pity comfort. Come on, let's start the diagnosis. I like pity, though. Please pity me. Please pity me. I have no son. All right, let's get this started. Hi, Shelly. Let's see what's wrong with you. Welcome to Doctor and Doctor Incorporated. I'm Doctor. He's and Doctor Incorporated. Boop. Not a problem. Sorry, no, you'll get used to this. Boom. Um, I'm sorry, doctor. But Those tights, ma'am. Where soon. did you get them? Is it possible to keep this as quick as That's a as great outfit, ma'am. You are styling this. Like, are you sure you're a stockbroker? Well, I 
You seem like that you run the stock industry. Hell yeah, girl. That's a girl boss right there. Yeah. Head to toe, girl boss. Right. You make me believe in capitalism. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's question. Let's let's have a little chat there, hun. I think it's just. I have a feeling we're gonna get quick answers and not fully explained answers. I think it's just a cold. Okay. You can't. Oh, nah, we're not this like that. Good. I've got a meeting soon. Um. I've had a fever for a while. There we go. I like that. A yep. fever that won't go away. Red flag. Fever, huh? Perhaps. Your brain's on fire! <laughs> Excuse me, but are you married? Because I got a fever and, you know. <laughs> I'm married to my work. I'm going to work myself to literal death in my 20s. But a woman's body temperature increases during pregnancy. We see a lot of women who think it's a fever. Uh -oh. Got a fever? You're pregnant. <laughs> well, thank you for thinking about that. Nope. But no. I'm totally concentrating on my job now. I see. I put gorilla glue down there. No one's getting in or out. Then let's make another hmm. piece, Roni. Well, we have cause to think it might be an infection now. Fever. I'm afraid you're dying now. <laughs> Thanks, Doctor Google. <laughs> you strike again. I've also lost some weight, but I think it's just because of the fever. No. Uh, no. 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 Weight loss. This isn't a magic fever. I'd, if, if that was the case, I'd be half my size. And I'd be half my size. So, what was Did you ever consider that what is it now? some people can um, can stand to I lose literally half of themselves themself and still be healthy? Oh, sure. Okay. I look in the mirror and I just go, Oh my god! I can lose half of me! Some people can lose half, some people can lose more than half, some people can't lose any because they're, they're perfectly balanced. Correct. As all things should be. Everybody's different, man. Oh, I see. I appreciate your cooperation. Roni, jot that down. Blush. New symptom observed. Weight loss. Don't worry, I won't tell anybody except my boss and the computer and... By the way, that's a nice beauty mark. Beauty mark? Oh, no, I don't, I don't know what this is. Oh. Oh. Besides uh, that... Been having night, night sweats. sweats. Uh oh. Yeah, if I, yeah. If I, I have night sweats, and if I had to get a tuberculosis <laughs> shot because I was suspected to have night sweats, then <laughs> night sweats, huh? Dysautonomia is the first thing to come to mind, but hmm. Dysautonomia. Been busy with work, right? What? Does it stress you out? Dysautonomia, but that don't know me. <laughs> stress? Nah, I never heard of it. <laughs> That's a good one, doctor. I love my job. Uh, I think you hate your work. <laughs> you're a strange one. It's either that or you're overworked, work, and it's actually causing day. you to collapse. She's a stockbroker. How bad can it be? <laughs> you ever see those? Uh, you ever see the stock market portrayed in the '90s, where it's literally just papers everywhere and people running around with chick like chickens with their heads cut off? I can't think of anything other than those. <clears throat> oh. I wasn't trying to hide this or anything. Uh huh. But I had an operation two months ago. It wasn't at this hospital. Oh, that might be something. Hopefully but, it wasn't. Oh come on. Hopefully it wasn't a botched procedure. That sucks. I had some kidney trouble and received a transplant. Is that it then? What? How is that not relevant? There's some odd bruises around the scar. There from we the go. Operation. Nope. <laughs> what? Around the operation scar? That worries me. Yeah, that might be internal bleeding. Could you tell me in detail where they are and what they look like? Oh yes, of course. The Let's say around my kidneys. Cleanly, so there isn't much of it left. Hmm. But there are these black bruise like things oh, around no. my I'll need to look at it in detail. Oh, I should be able to have Would kidney failure or something. Either. Or sepsis. Yes, if you need to see it for the examination, I understand. Oh, so cooperative. It's strange. I made sure to take the medication they gave me too. But that's it, really. See? It's just a <laughs> except for the bruising around your kidneys. Yeah, that's kind of major. Uh, all right. Well, uh, so, all right. So around the scar, let's take a look. Let's see them. All right, step it out. Oh. She even matches. Wait. What? <laughs> No! No! <gasps> Holy shit, Roni, did you get that? Did you get any of that? Pretty lady! <laughs> okay. One more time. Oh, right, right. Position, and then... All right. Uh, 
That's hers. That sounds normal. But like, uh, what is that? All right, lungs. Okay. Her lungs are fine. Yep. Other one's fine too. Hurt. Everything's fine stethoscope wise, I think. Yep, just sounds about right. Oh, well, we saw the scars. That's very bad. All right, visual exam. <laughs> Your knees? No, not no, the knee. No, like, not a knee. It, and again. <laughs> I want to I look at that. Yeah, I want to look at that. That's the abnormality. It's true there are dark red pigment spots around the operation scar. Did these exist before the kidney transplant? No, I'm sure of it. I'd have noticed if those were there before. True. Did you show these to your doctor? What did he say about them? This he connected the them I've seen a doctor since with the a marker. I've been poke, so poke, busy at work poke, poke. That I couldn't keep any appointments. I see. This now this was a house. Exam. She'd be like, yeah, Morning. these, I never noticed them so... And then, you know, beep, 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 it's like, okay, well, she thought she was faking, but it turns out she wasn't faking about something else she didn't know anything about. It turns out she's got a bad case of the toxic ooze. Yeah, my dad had that. So are we done here, or...? Uh, is there anything around her neck? A necklace, that's not normal. Okay. Uh, how... Yeah, I don't see anything. She's not, like, twitching or anything. Nothing wrong with her eyes. Hmm. Hair's fine. Okay. Are we going to look at an imaging lab then, or...? Let's take a look. <clears throat> Doctor, the results from the hey, look at that! Okay. I know. I came here to check them. Let's see what's wrong with her skin. Let's take a look. Okay. Thallium. Alright, so it's full body. Uh, that... Mmm... There's the... Is that the... Huh. I don't see much difference. They seem about the same. Wait. There's a little extra down here, I think. Yeah, there is. Oh, you're right. Right there. Okay, right there. So... Uptake of thallium matches the pigment uh -huh. spots on skin. Barely There's saw that. The pigment spots are tumors. Oh no! 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 I always hate it when those gosh dang tumors just start showing up. Diagnosis. You have skin cancer, ma'am. I, I, I think he mentioned that we should go take a look and see what we have going on here. Let's see what the options are. All right, let's see. We have Petraeus. <laughs> we got this. Petty irises. Little shaped see. rashes. We don't have rashes, but we do have red pigment, pigment spots. Oh, damn it! They keep wanting to go A and B, <laughs> like always. It's right, okay. So. okay. Pigment, pigment spots. spots. Skin condition: uh, lack of appetite. We don't right. have got fever. Uh, no joint pain. I think that's pretty, yeah. pretty done. Arrhythmia multiform. And, uh, symmetrical pigment spots. Okay. Uh, light headache, fever, and joint pain. Positive reaction to antibodies is present in the blood analysis. But no spot. night sweats. Malignant melanoma. Uh, Skin cells that create melanin and show pigment spots along with oddly shaped tumors. 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 Exam. That's oh, wait. That's focusing mainly on tumors, though. Yeah. I don't think it's melanoma. Carposis sarcoma! Jeez. 
Uh, including whoop, fever, we weight loss, weight loss, night sweats. Oh boy, fever, pigment spots, pigment spots, and, and uh, 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 all our symptoms apply to. It, there's a big missing part there, though. But are you concerned about something? We don't have enough information. There's no way Kaposi sarcoma occurs unless there was an extreme decrease in the immune system. If we don't solve that portion, it's impossible to make a diagnosis. I think we gotta do some blood work. Oh, I feel like it's right there in front of me. Roni, do you remember anything that might help? What did she say? I record only pertinent facts in my memory. Useless! Would you like to change these settings so that I record every detail <laughs> of the diagnosis? Yes! Let's not. I mean, no. Yeah, no, no, no. Like not, off all my we don't need every single piece of information. Oh, well. I think it's time to listen to what the patient has to say again. Oh, did All we right. miss something? Well, I don't think we missed anything. It's it's just that we might need some more information. Yep. Let's see what she has to say. Well, well let's see if there's anything new. Let's try and be delicate said. about this, as delicate as possible. Kicks open door. Hey, um, you got AIDS? Sorry to keep you waiting when you're so busy. <laughs> oh no. How are you feeling? Nothing much has changed in particular. Um, is this gonna take long? Cancel all your appointments. Don't get so hasty. It's going to take a little more time until you're diagnosed. I see. Um, I've got a meeting soon, though. You're not making that meeting. Okay. One more time. I think it's just a call. Uh. You um, I've had a fever for a while and it won't go away. Hmm. Mm. And it won't go away. Severely inhibited immune system is a prerequisite. Yeah, if it won't yeah. go away. I mean, just go through it again. See if anything uh, jumps out. I think just a cold. Um, soon. That's what strikes out at me. I've also lost some weight, but I besides lost some that, weight. I sweat, fever. Oh, but I had an operation. Two had months ago, operation. I wasn't trying to hide anything. Operation. What was that sound that she made? They're they're pointing us in a direction here. I think it's I'm looking at one direction. So <clears throat> oh, there's a clearing of the throat. Okay. Um, I, got a fever I think it's this. But that's what you got for a for a part of the diagnosis. That's yeah, what you clicked for, on. for the fever. But now I think they want me to look at the won't go away part. I've also lost some weight, but I think it's just because. besides that I can't think of it. Hmm. <clears throat> Wasn't trying to hide this oh, okay. One tried to hide this. That was just leading into the to hide the, the, the thing I'm about to tell you. Right? I I really think it's the I've had a fever for a while. You think thing. so? Because that's the only thing that points at a I compromised immune system. Okay. Um, I've had I mean, a fever for a while and it won't go away. A while. Usually you have a fever. It's gone in like a day or two. A day, yeah. Oh, um, no, he's oh nope. He's already confirmed the symptoms, so that must not be what he's looking for. I've also lost some weight. Besides that, I can't think of anything other Let's than Let's go else. past the kidneys. I can't remember anything that uh, happened after that. But I had an operation two months ago. I had some kidney trouble and received, received a transplant. There's okay. some odd bruises around the scar from the operation. You think? The transplanted kidney could have had AIDS. You think that could? You want to give it a try? Let's see. <laughs> ah! Throwing me off my pace. It's strange. I made sure to take the medication they gave me. Wait, what was the medication? But that's it, really. Think. I'm a diagnostician. There it is. Mm. Yeah, what was the, the meds? Medication prescribed after the kidney transplant. Hey, I'm sorry, but can I confirm something? Immunosuppressive drugs. Oh, no. Um, that's what's causing. Oh, no. She's yeah, suppressed. Right. Oh but that's God! Something you need to know when making a diagnosis. Now everything depends on the results <laughs> of your biopsy. No. You you were basically in a cesspool at the, your place of work. Have come back from the pathology <laughs> All right, let's take a look. The antibody reaction was positive, oh, but they failed to man. specify the virus causing the disease. Oh, they failed man. to specify the virus. What in the world are they doing? What do you mean they couldn't specify the virus? They don't know what the virus is? Shall I explain the 1,874 patterns of conjectures in regards to it? Alright, oh. don't be cute about it. 
Easy no, there. That's all right. It shouldn't be a problem to make a diagnosis. Roni, let's go back to the office. Time to narrow down our possible candidates. Okay. You got it, friend. Positive antibody reaction. That means that we're, this is going to take us to uh, yeah, that initial diagnosis, but I think he's going to be like, I don't know about that, and he's going to keep going. Well, let's take a look. So, We're definitely onto something. The getting the getting the time. immune system was probably the thing that helped us out. But we also need to fully confirm. And da, 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 such as some medication and other immunity altering situations. Bing bing. Ah, Kaposi syndrome or sarcoma? Excuse me. So it is Kaposi sarcoma, but. Why? The period of time until the onset is too short. Hmm. It's similar to Kaposi's sarcoma. This is something else. It's Carl's sarcoma. <laughs> we have an urgent contact. Oh. Please head immediately uh -oh. to the examination. Yes. I think we're about to get our second symptom here. She's coughing up blood. Well, that's not good. Right. I'm Wait. Way. Huh? Multiple yeah. patients? Abrupt stomach pain. Uh, Readmitted? Oh. This may be related to the tumors discovered before. Uh, ah. Yeah. Great. Oh dear. Roni, you ready? Yes, doctor. Mask up, doctor. Mask We're going in. Mask up and put them gloves. Patient was diagnosed with Kaposi's sarcoma, but the onset occurred very quickly. Readmitted for abdominal pain. Here we go. Part two. Let's get the full story here, ma'am, if we could please. Hey, are you all right? Hi. Oh, just heartburn. Never mind. I took some Pepto. I'm fine now. Oh. Well, I went to work, but uh, went to work. I just went into my office. <laughs> I snuck out. What? It's a good thing we <laughs> your hospital's located right next to the Rony, stock market. Uh, <laughs> I was wondering what all that noise was. Yes, doctor. Begin when you are ready. All okay. right, here we go. What happened? Um, my stomach suddenly started hurting. Well, that's a symptom. I see. So these are the sudden like abdominal Like sudden, like... Uh, yeah, like you're being stabbed in the gut. Not like a oh, stomachache that just notice. got worse. It's just like... Oh! Yep. Symptom observed. Stomachache. Okay. Let's see what else we can find. And... I feel a little nauseous, yep. too. Okay, that's good. Well, that's not good. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Keep it coming. <laughs> Good. Give me that diagnosis I'm looking for. Let me solve the puzzle. Make sure you're getting all this. Understood, doctor. New symptom observed. Nausea. <laughs> retained <laughs> nausea. <laughs> Roni, observe this. Observe this. Bang! Please, doctor. Death. See if there's anything wrong with me. I've told you everything I've been feeling. Let's see. If there's anything else worth there. mentioning. There. Right there. I, I have been feeling, um... A, a little bloated. Bloat, 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 bloat! Get him with the bloat, bloat! Her abdomen is bloated. <laughs> Stomach Roni, ache. Add that to her record. Bloated. Fatty, fat, fat. <laughs> No! <laughs> Be nice! Get Rooney, please. <laughs> <laughs> fat, fatty, fat, fat. <laughs> Porker pig. Oink, oink. Lately, uh. <sighs> Please ignore my fucking asshole robot friend. And spit it out. I'm having trouble using the toilet fully. You understand? Yeah. Like, do you almost shit or? Hmm. Right this time. <laughs> In other words. Like, I can't just- I can't figure it out. Well, let's just, well, let's just say I can't make a trauma dump like I used to. Like, either she's got incontinence or whatever, or she's trying to poop in a urinal. <laughs> I can't keep going into the wrong restroom. Uh, huh, no. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine. I understand. I, I I pick up what you're putting down. You can't make boom boom in the pot. Got it. You're unable to produce those things on the toilet. Yes? Yes. Gotcha. Now we're getting somewhere. Rony, make a note of this. <laughs> he claps his hands together. <laughs> oh shit! Alright! Making a note, the fat fatty fat can't poop. 
<laughs> it, it ain't going nowhere. <laughs> Jesus. All right, what else? Oh, okay, so that's get, it. I that's guess it. that's it. All right. Uh, let's you, go I diagnosed you with uh, screwed. Yeah, this is uh, this is getting worse. All right. All right. Nothing. More, nothing bad visually, but the stomach should be. Ah! It's fighting back. It's roaring at me. Yeah, it's that, mad at that's, me. That's not good. This is. Your intestinal bowel sounds are a bit violent. A bit violent? 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 It's rated M for mature. Just a little Mommy, bit. Write this down too. Whew. New symptom observed. Aggravated bowel sounds. <laughs> Maybe you're trying to lose all that weight, you fat fatty fat. <laughs> Roni, there's a lion in her stomach. Stop! <laughs> Breathing still sounds good. Both breathings. And heart has not elevated. Sounds yeah, it's good the same. There, right. This sounds like a completely and stomach you know, problem. Given these symptoms, it appears to be a problem with You might have an acute case of right. ulcerative colitis, ma'am. An X-ray and a CT exam. I've already sent in the request, doctor. Sweet. <laughs> good call. Maybe you should become a diagnostician. I'm going to replace you, Doctor. All We're going to lay you doctor. off in one year. I'm sorry, what? You'll get severance. Yeah, yeah, I was just joking. But 50% if we know. can't negotiate by the end of the month. Oh my god, that sucks. I just watched a Simpsons episode where everybody at the nuclear power plant got replaced with robots <laughs> except Homer. And he accidentally reprogrammed them and turned them into killing machines just oh, because he wanted somebody to talk to. Up. <laughs> it was a really good episode. All right, let's see what we got here. Remembering when they uh, scanned the deed to their house, and the machine just goes, "You are on your fifth mortgage." <laughs> All right, look at the X-ray. Yeah, let's take a look at the X-ray. The cross-ray. You have swallowed a phone, man. Uh, what? that was it. Yes. What is that, though? What the hell? What did you eat? Fluid oh no! Uh, it's a nebu. Air fluid level. Yikes. Yikes. There's hair getting in there? Formation that's... Uh, that's not good. Alright, let's take a look here. I think everything else is good. He's looking at that spot, but that spot's there. Yeah, I think everything else is... I mean, that phone there. Yeah. That, that was the thing that jumped out at me. That's that's pretty big. Alright, we got the CT scan. I think most of these are gonna this is gonna, gonna be a little tougher. Alright. Alright. This is the patients. Normal. Looking okay, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Okay. This one. So look. Oh wait. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Ah! Oh my God! It jumped. Atrophying kidneys. Atrophying kidneys. Her kidneys are shutting down. Hey, Roni. Oh Would my God. <laughs> Would you call this a symptom? Oh no, that's totally normal. What the fuck do you think? You got a case of small <laughs> kidney here. Oh. Ah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> without extracting the diseased ones. Well, that means this symptom's already been treated. Correct, Doctor. It does not need to be recorded as a symptom. It, it, it feels related, though, doesn't I guess it? you're right. I mean, uh, I was just testing you. Aha! Uh -huh. Good work. I'm sorry. Heckin' got him. fully believe you, Doctor. It's almost like you're being controlled by someone hey, who's not a real doctor. Play along. All right, well, let's, let's take a look. All right, I think, I think that's everything else. But that's, uh... Which photo are we on? We're on the second. Second? Here's the third. I didn't see anything drastically change. Mm. Yeah, nothing... Nothing that I can see, really. Yeah, I thought I was seeing something, but I don't think so. A lot of, lot of little... Wait a minute. A lot of little parts here. Oh! Ah! 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 ah, ah. What's that? Yeah, what is that? Are these shadows in small intestine tumors? She's got uh, tumors everywhere! No! It's hard to make a call. Roni, give me your opinion on this. I think milk would be a great pairing with a steak. My answers are what? based on statistics. <laughs> oh, oh, thank you, oh, Dr. Gate. Thank you, Dr. Oh, Gate. Thank you, Dr. Gate. I'm currently collating this data with tumor Okay. 
tumors. Last time I awesome. asked for a quick answer. My calculations show there is approximately ninety two percent. Hey, that's good enough for me. That's an almost an A minus. Which means there's a non zero chance it could be candy. Whoa. Uh, anyways, yeah. Oh. Let's just call them tumors for now, man. <laughs> Alright, definitely tumors. <clears throat> definitely yeah. tumors. We must not do that, Doctor. There remains an 8% probability. Look, we, we, got, we gotta make a call here. The chances are high because she had yeah, a transplant and, and it didn't take very well. well just There's some the sort of rejection yeah. happening in that body of hers. New symptom observed. Tumor shadows on small intestine. Yeah, don't, no likey. No likey she's, on that one. She's gaslighting me though because they, they could not be tumors because we could get in there with as Tomoe and be like, oh, there's nothing here. Not a tumor. I think that's it. We've gone through the x-ray and the CT scan. Diagnosis time. All right, here we go. Hell yeah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Time to figure out what's wrong! <laughs> what if Gabe did that in his spare time? He's just like, he walks into his office and he just goes, It's time for a diagnosis. I think the good doctor would be a lot less charming. <laughs> what are you saying? You don't want the diagnosis gremlin going into his office and figuring out what's wrong with you? I think we can, put, we can keep that on the cutting room floor. <laughs> Paralytic il, 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 ilus. Condition in the context of obstructive motor. Uh, motor. Well, so she doesn't have paralysis. Stomach pain. Nausea. Constipation. Constipation. Abdominal bloating. Dead. Oscillation. Lack of bowel sounds. It, that's absolutely not her no, problem. No, she's got lying in there. No, no. Occlusive ilius. That could be the opposite. Narrow become blocked, obstructing the intestines. We've got stomach a stomach egg. We've no, got yeah. nausea. Constipation. We've got constipation and abdominal bloating with aggravated, aggravated bowel, bowel sounds. sounds. Air fluid level with tumor, tumor shadows. shadows. Hey! Whoa! Intestinal ileus. Intestinal ileus originating from ileus. I'm so intestine. sorry, ma'am. Your diagnosis is getting worse and worse. You better not come back a third time. Oh, it turns out that her leg got amputated. Yeah, I tried to go back to work and I just got hit by a car. It and fell off. I don't know what happened. <laughs> Can I go back to work yet? Actually, that's a, a good thing. We should check on all of her other organs because they may have been infected with tumors as well. I'll make preparations. I think we're going to come back. She's going to be like covered red or purple or something. Oh, God. Phase three?